What is up guys, this is the Awesome Nerd Show and today we are unboxing the Loot Crate for this month. Um, so I have no clue what the theme is. Um, I'm sure once I see some items or something I'll probably be like, oh yeah, that's what it is. But I can't remember off the top of my head. So let's open it and see what we get. Um, we'll start off with our shirt. Um, so let's see what it is. It says Wallace Corporation. I have no clue what this is, but this shirt looks really small. And it looks weird. I don't understand what this shirt it says. Blade Runner. Oh, okay. So there we go. Blade Runner. What? Twenty forty nine. It says yeah. So that's some Blade Runner. Which I've never seen Blade Runner, but this almost looks like a girl shirt. Like by the size and like layout of it, it looks like a girl shirt. Like design wise and stuff. Not exactly sure. So it definitely won't be. Neither of us will be wearing it. But anyway, but that's kind of weird. Like I said, I don't know anything about Blade Runner, so I don't really have any connection to that or anything at all. Uh, but next up we have, I don't know what this is, it's Aliens, and it says, Collector Series Queen, ta okay. <laughs> Queen Takes Bishop, so it's kind of like a play on the uh, uh, chess set there, but it's an alien queen with bishop on its tail, it looks like. So it's like a little figure of that. I don't know, I don't know what this is supposed to be for. It um, says it's made by... Fat Mojo, and it has a weird like face logo there on the bottom. I thought this was maybe like since it says Queen Takes Bishop. Oh, it's like a whole thing you have to put together. Um, but we have the Queen's head here, so obviously we have her body and tail and everything. And it goes on. It has a little stand for it to go on to. And then we have a kit, um, Bishop Bishop kit, uh, character type thing um, figure. So I'm trying to say here that you obviously stick on it and so it's got the tail coming through it like it does at the end of Aliens too and so that's kind of cool and so um, bro if you want to put that together for me so that's kind of cool like I said I thought maybe since it says Queen Takes Bishop is going to be like a chess piece so like you could buy a bunch of like alien figures and stuff and build like a chess board or something um, but it's still cool just a little figure it's kind of funny um, so this is looks cool so we've gotten something like this in the past from another crate it could be loot crate as well but it's one of the wood models and it is of r2d2 which is awesome because r2d2 is one of my favorite characters <laughs> and um the only problem is is that there it's all um brown so it looks like that when you put it together and so you have to get like paint or colors and stuff to get it to actually um be the proper color so there's what it would look like if you paint it or color it properly or whatever um, so they're real, these are nice and fun to put together because they're easy to do, or relatively easy to do. They're not overly complicated, but um, they look kind of cool. So we got a Captain America shield from one of them. Oh, there's an at, -AT my favorite. Um, so I'll definitely do that at some point. I don't know what this has to do. Oh, it must be for some uh, challenge or competition thing with the R2 that you can do and win something from Loot Crate, so that's what that is for. Next up we have a Star Trek The Next Generation um, Mere Broken Origin of Data um, and it's a comic it doesn't I don't see what number it is but it is that there so we have what looks like a, a Jean-Luc Picard and I assume Data obviously there and he's like all split apart and robot stuff but this is looks more like it's more of an advertisement for their Star Trek crate that they have coming I don't know it just says a mystery crate. It doesn't say, or I guess it says subscription, so it must be a multi-month crate. I thought it was like a one-time off. So there's Star Trek crate. So if you're a fan of Star Trek, you can get that crate and, I guess, enjoy it or whatever. And then it looks like the last thing out of here is our pin for the month, which looks really cool. Um, but it's loot, um, September 2017 Robotic is the theme. I had no clue about that. I don't remember that at all. But we have a little robot here. It doesn't really have a name, but I think we may... Um, figured out but it's got a cool little robot right there and so you can see like in the bottom here it has like the LC for the Loot Crate logo it has a little like speedometer some gears and some like lever or whatever frequency things whatever of like sound and stuff so it's kind of cool just a cool little robot and then to go with that robot I'll just show the box it turns into like a uh, cereal box but it's Cog Krispies Fortified with essential elements and alloys for extra processing power. And so it says Cog Krispies for silicon-based con constructs. 
exclusive mystery item inside. Oh, and the mystery item's the alien. Which, speaking of that, bro got it put together. So there's what it looks like. So you can see it's obviously the queen alien with Bishop there on her tail. <laughs> that just looks so cool. That's such an awesome figure. I wish... I, I hope they make more of these because it'd be so cool to get these. It'd be cool to get those and put it all together. So this is what the inside of it looks like. So there's like the front of the box, the side with the nutritional facts. And so you can see all sorts of like uh, materials and stuff broken down in there. And then even has activities on the box and stuff that you can do in little maze and stuff. So that's just really funny, all the work they put into it. And stuff, so that's kind of cool. You know how you said you'd like another one of those uh, alien figures? Yeah. Since it's Aliens, which is the sequel, they could do Ripley in her... Uh, robotic suit. Yeah, robotic suit holding like one of the aliens off. That'd um, be cool. So now we're going to go into our magazine. Of course, it says Robotic right there on the front. September 2017. Um, so first up, we have our um, Blade Runner 2049. It says just blur... Blade Runner 2049 t-shirt. Um, and it looks like it glows in the dark, the Wallace logo on it. And of course it does have a girl robot there, but I don't know. It just, the sizing and look of the shirt just looks really weird. So I don't know um, what that's all about. Then we got our Star Trek Next Generation comic, which I'm not a fan of Star Trek. I'm a Star Wars guy, but um, I don't care about that comic. But then what I do like, really like from this box is, of course, the R2-D2 wood model. So I'll, I'll definitely be putting that together. Just need to figure out the paint. And then probably, like I said, the best item out of this is the Queen Takes Bishop figure. That's just so awesome. Um, then we got our monthly pin, which um, said, just says Loot Bot. Um, oh, it says Loot Bot is very heavy and hard to carry around, but now it's much easier to take Loot Bot with you everywhere with this adorable pin. So apparently that's just Loot Bot. Um, and then some about this stuff. So I did notice, unless it's just hidden in here. Oh, then we got, of course, the picture of the cereal box, whatever robot thing. Um, it looks like they did take out um, the, like, whatever the mystery stuff, the things where you're supposed to do all the little clues and stuff with the little packet. It looks like they did take that out, so people must have not stopped doing it like me, who felt it wasn't worth the time and effort just to get a little patch. Um, but that looks like that is it for our robotic box this month. So, bro, what was your favorite item out of this box? Queen takes Bishop. That's what I assume. This figure is just so cool. Like, this has got to be the, one of the coolest figures I have ever seen. Um, just because I love, um, I really like aliens and, of course, the alien queen. Like, I of course, the alien queen up there and stuff. Um, but that <laughs> she has Bishop on her tail. Like, she kills him in the, in the aliens. It's just so cool. That's just such an awesome figure. Like I said, I want to like look up this company and stuff and see if they have any more. Like I said, I'm not sure if it's the right name or not, but it says uh, Fat Mojo. Um, and it says Build, Collect, and Share on the box. So I assume it can go somewhere. And it says www.fatmojo.com. So they do have a website, so I'll definitely be looking at that. Um, but I really like the R2-D2, but the Alien is definitely my favorite. But that's going to be it for this Loot Crate unboxing. So if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments you have down below. Let me know what your favorite item out of the box was. Um, and hit that red subscribe button to check out all our videos. And we'll see you next time.